What is Jody going to be remembered for? Probably, if you take the entire city, the Castle Gallery, which she sort of built into a landmark. I mean, it was one of the most recognized locations in the city for 25 years, just because of the openness and, and, and humbleness that she sort of operated this from. She poured her heart and soul into this gallery. But, you know, what is a gallery? It's a place for collectors to come in contact with the artists. It's where the rubber hits the road, is the art gallery. And she'll be remembered for bringing those people together. We talked about um, what we're going to miss the most, and, and it's belief. You know, you've got this fancy castle that's, you know, a million dollar building, and you had this little powerful woman that believed in you. You know, a lot of mentorship happens when things aren't perfect. She's there in those moments, the, the moments that are difficult, uh, where, where you, need, you need some advice, but it's in the moments where you're just not sure what the future holds. And you've got somebody with an amazing amount of experience that knows tons of artists and have seen, you know, the roller coasters of life giving you advice, that's pretty invaluable. And having somebody that believes in you is incredible. There's, there's a, a confession to being an artist. You're confessing your soul on canvas. Because in the end, there's a big connection between art and love. And why, what is that connection? It's about giving. The artist gives of herself, like giving love. She taught artists how to unlock their souls. She said, you know, put a little blue in your sky. How about a little more sun up there in the corner? And once you teach somebody how to do that, it's like saying, put a little more love in your life. I think the city has gotten really good at celebrating life and saying, you know what? Sometimes really great experiences are worth a little extra dollars and cents. Um, I think that that can be traced to Jody in a lot of ways. Um, because like I said, she was selling artistic moments that you hang on your wall.